Hello skeletons, this is Disney Queen Skelly here. Welcome back to another How to Write Arabesh. So today we are doing punctuations. Yes, we are done with the alphabet. We are now doing punctuations because the final video for this is going to be complete sentences. So you guys are going to be learning how to do complete sentences in Arabesh. So we're going to be learning how to do a period, a comma, a question mark, exclamation point, colon, semicolon, dash, slash, quotation marks with single quotation marks and double quotation marks, parentheses, and something called, oh, credits. That's like their money thing. So we're going to start with a comma. So a normal comma, let me get my stuff going here. A normal comma looks like this, right? Just looks like a crescent. So their comma is literally just a straight line. And the straight line is actually going to be at the top of your page instead of like at the bottom of your page where commas usually go. Next, we're gonna learn about periods. And no, I am not talking about female periods. Uh, we're gonna be talking about this kind of period, which is just a little dot. I'll make that dot a little bit bigger. Let's see, let's just do that. There you go, that's a period. So their period, um, instead of, so the comma was the one dash, a period is actually two straight lines, like two dashes that are gonna go to the top of your page as well. So next we are going to be talking about a question mark. This one has a bit more detail to it. So this is our normal question mark. Their question mark has a line going up, a tiny line going across, and then it kind of curves like that, like a little half crescent moon. And that is a question mark in Arabesh. Next, we are going to be uh, doing an exclamation point. So our normal exclamation point looks like that. Their exclamation points are just two diagonal lines going down from the left up into the right. That is an exclamation mark. Next, we are going to be learning about a colon. So a regular colon looks like this. Their colon, it almost looks like a less than sign, but um, it's it's a basically a line going from diagonal left to bottom right and then a little straight line going across and that's their colon next we'll be learning about a semicolon which a normal semicolon you know looks like that that looks like a j <laughs> oh well you guys know what i meant so literally their colon is um it is a straight line but instead of it kind of being like the comma Theirs is a little bit longer, so kind of like that. So when you're doing the uh, comma versus the semicolon, just make sure that the semi semicolon is a longer line instead of like a dash or something. Next, we are going to be learning about a dash. This is what our dash looks like. And I kid you not, this is what their dash looks like. Literally just the same dash. There's nothing different to it. Next, we are going to be learning about the another dash, it's this dash, our normal, like, when you do, like, HTTP colon slash blah blah blah, um, theirs is kind of tricky looking, I'm gonna see if I can mimic it as well as I can, it's a line going down, a line across, and then a line going down, so it looks kind of like that, that's kind of funky looking, but that's how they did it, so that is their dash, and then next we are going to be learning about um, the single quotation marks like that. So theirs pretty much just looks the same. It's just a little tick at the top. You go down and a little curve in. You know what? I'm not sure to do that a little bit better. So it's a line across, down, and across, across, down, and across. And those are their single quotation marks. Now their double quotation marks are a little bit different. So our double quotation marks just look like this, right? Their double quotation marks look like this. So it's almost like you're doing a check. So you're gonna go diagonally left, down to the right, straight up. Then you're gonna go down in a straight line and then diagonally up. All right, and that's how you do the um, the quotation marks. So again, it's straight down up to the left and then straight down up to the right in a diagonal. Next, we are going to be doing parentheses. So parentheses for us, oh, that's big. Parentheses for us looks like this. 
their parentheses look like this. They're like, it's like that Tetris symbol. You'll see what I mean. So it's a straight line down and then a little tick to the left and then another straight line down and then a little tick to the left. Obviously they have to be the same size, but you know what I mean. That's how they do their parentheses, basically just flip the image. And then last but not least, we'll learn how to do their credits sign, which is how they spend money there. So our credits are dollars, so they look like that. Their credits are kind of similar, so it's the number seven, and then there's two tick marks here. And that is it for today's Arabesh lesson. Thank you all so much for watching. And in the next Arabesh video, I'll be teaching you how to write complete sentences. So I thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye, little skeletons. Stay safe, and I love you guys.